Hi students, welcome back. And in this tutorial, we're going to do Power Break 6.2.6. .6. So the first instruction there is to open or retrieve the file praise from your folder. So I'm going to go to the praise file and I'm going to open it up. If a document is asking, if, if a document looks like this when you open it up for the first time, protected view, please just enable editing so that you are able to actually work with the document. The next instruction is edit the document as indicated in the text and according to the instructions below. Center the main heading at the top of the document. All right, so the main heading is this heading over here. So we need to center it at the top of the document. So what we're going to do is we're going to select the heading the best thing to do is after you have selected the heading is to go to the paragraph group launcher, which is over here. So here we have normal buttons that we can use. But if you go into the paragraph group launcher, you have actually more options. Like for example, under general, you can change the alignment. You can change it to center. Or Eventually, we will be able to change the indentation over here, and you can also change your line spacing over here. But let's continue with the activity. So after you've changed the alignment to center, you can click OK. Next instruction number four. Change the alignment of the rest of the text to full. What that means is, as you can see, my text on my left hand side they are all underneath each other but when we get to the right hand side it's not because this text is currently left aligned now let me show you if i select the first paragraph i will notice that the left align option is highlighted if i click on center that's what center looks like right align and the last one is fully justified and you can see the example, it's, it's, it's like a block. It's equally aligned on both sides, left and right. So if I click on this option, everything on my left is aligned. Everything on my right is aligned. All right, so they want the whole document to be fully justified. So what we're going to do is we're going to press the control key on our keyboard and we're going to press the A key at the same time so that our all of our text gets selected but please take note even the heading has been selected at this stage all right so the whole text has been selected so what i'm going to do is i'm going i can either go into the group launcher and change the alignment to justified or i can use this option over here the last justification option to justify my text or I could use a shortcut control and the letter J on my keyboard to justify my text. But remember, the instruction said the rest of the document, not the heading. The heading should be center aligned. So I'm, I can either use this option or I can use the group launcher option. Or I can use a shortcut control and E for center control and the letter E. Okay, next instruction indent the first paragraph by two centimeters on both sides. What that means is first paragraph select and then we need to go and indent it on both sides by two centimeters so select go to paragraph group launcher and under indentation left and right change it to two so two centimeters left two centimeters right and you click o okay. so it's been pushed from the left two centimeters on my ruler pushed to the right two centimeters about um, two centimeters from the right side 
Okay, so number six onwards, we are going to do it in the next video. And I will also show you how to change something to bold and how to do numbering. Thank you for watching.